things you're going to need one is a box I got this one from textbook center it's a gift box then some fake foam flowers I got this off Aliexpress some of them are damaged but we'll see what to do I got a bunch of four I hope they'll be enough the next thing you're going to need is scissors and this is the sexy pair I got a knife oh my goodness um, yeah a lot of things are gonna go on here we're also gonna need some floral foam I got this off eBay and it's supposed to be for real flowers but I'm gonna use it on fake flowers because that's how we do and last but not least we're gonna use some spray paint this is spray paint I've had for such a long time hence why it's looking funny but it's black it's matte black and oh god I'm sorry <laughs> it's matte black and that's what I want to use for my box so push that aside and place that over there so basically for this DIY project that's all we're gonna need let's get started hoping you guys can see what I'm doing I'm gonna take my box and I'm gonna spray paint it with the black sorry I'm gonna spray paint it with the black spray paint this should be easy just gonna do the outer sides first. I'm not gonna spray paint like a quarter of the top of the box, that way it looks very nice and chic and uniform. So what I'm going to do is, I feel like this stalk is a tad bit too long. Um, I'm going to snip it off just a tiny bit with the scissors. And I'm just going to do the same length for all of them. gonna clean up my mess because I'm a clean girl and I don't like having dirt around okay so give me a second now I'm gonna take my foam block and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna measure it up against the box this is shedding so much I've never touched this in my life and it feels weird I'm just measuring it up against the box and it's um, a bit big so I'm just gonna take my handy knife and I'm just gonna pierce through this part this is really easy. Oh, sorry. This is really easy to cut through and it's so soft. Honestly, it feels so soft. There is our foam. So I'm just going to place this in my box. So this is my foam laid out. It's not the best, honestly. I cut it up a lot more, but I don't have that many to work with. So I'm just going to do what I can so basically what I'm doing is I'm puncturing the foam and putting my flower and pushing it so that it lays exactly next to the other flower that way they're arranged and nice But I am an artist. Do not question me, okay, fam? Oh, look at that. So, I don't know if you guys can see, but the first row is done, like the first outer thingy. And I'm just gonna prop them up a bit because they're a bit down. 
some of them. So just go as you do this, like fix it as you go. It's not going to be perfect, but it's still going to be so pretty. So as long as the stalks are not being seen and the arrangement looks proper, you're good to go. Okay, so these are my flowers, but as you can see, I have gaps. Um, and I'm just gonna take more flowers and fill that in until it's super super full and then that's basically it I think I'm gonna print off a sticker and place it on the side of the box We'll see how that goes But basically just fill in your gaps and just arrange them to your liking and you'll have your box So I'll be back with the finished product mm -hmm. 